Hello? It's been too long. I wish I could say this was a social call. I told you after the events on Tython and Korriban that I had particular concerns, suspicions. I was right. The Empire is in serious danger. I can't tell you any more over Hollow. Come and see me on the planet Manan at the nearest opportunity. All will be explained. Welcome. So good to see you again. As implied in our last brief communication, Darth Arcus is at the center of a grand conspiracy. Arcus had the Jedi Temple raided to acquire knowledge of Rakata technology that he could use to harm the Empire. Even now, he plots against us. What can you tell me about this technology? Nothing, I'm afraid. He smartly kept the details hidden from me, but we're very close to the truth now. I followed Arcus to a secure undersea laboratory here on Manan, where he's working with a Selkath geneticist on something. I've been trying to learn more. I've also discovered that Colonel Darrock secured passage to the same laboratory. He was behind the Republic's raid on Korriban. It seems to me that Arcus and Darrock are working together. That's my feeling as well, but we won't know for certain unless we get into that laboratory. As I said, it's a well-protected facility. You'll have to make your way through heavily armed Selkath and dismantle their security grid. You're not coming? I'd intended to confront Darth Arcus myself, but I sense a presence here. A potential ally. I'll remain in touch and let you know how my search progresses. May the Force be at your service. This is Lana. Darth Arcus is not far. I can sense him. We have to learn what he and the Selkath are doing down there and confront him. To have your run of the place, you'll need to shut down the security grid. You have the coordinates now. I'll stay in touch. Confesses what Kira Kanban. My most sincere apologies for his outburst. Please don't leave us here to rot! I implore you! I didn't come here to listen to you bicker. Now say something useful, or lose the ability to speak. I am C2D4, former translator to Her Eminence, Queen Lena of Onderon. And this is my current master, the renowned illicit transport specialist, Jakaro. A smuggler, in other words? Jakara was hired, quite innocuously, by a Selkath geneticist named Garima. We delivered a large shipment of perfectly legal medical supplies here to this facility. Imagine our consternation, when Garima then had us imprisoned and interrogated most harshly by two awful creatures. <laughs> So it's true. Darth Arcus and Colonel Darrock are working together. Is that significant? An extra hand wouldn't be entirely unwelcome. Interested? We shall endeavor to hurry and regroup with you at our earliest opportunity. 
Nice to see you've made a new friend. Or friends, as it were. But a warning. You're about to encounter members of the Order of Shasa. Four sets of Selkath who are neither Jedi nor Sith. Their complicity here does not bode well for us. Our ally just made note of strange power signatures in your vicinity. He believes they may be emanating from Rakata technology. It warrants a closer look. Tap into a nearby console so we can investigate. Confesses von Kira Kranban. Von Yokajirando. The hard way. Nembo King Avila Gito Turko. Latate Hata Mogot A. Care to tell me where your underwriters are? Mine Gin Ritet Neste Ahoje Hatal Al Alasonak Oraban. Hosu Idon Kera Stulas Elva Lasto as Bolt Ahatasa. Amun Kaja Kostunk, Vota Hoje Mar Inlet, Ete Valahol. Eves Tob Ere Ni as Igrit, Len Parnata Fader Zetin. He mustn't get another chance to betray us! Shoot him already! <laughs> Let your hate be your guide, Jakaro. <laughs> How very unexpected. This is the potential complication you sensed? No, this is not my advisor, but rather an associate. It would appear Benico laid out a convincing case that I'm up to no good. This is no way to greet an associate, Argus. You should be nice and close so I can hold out my hand and strangle you with it. Such a passion for violence. I suppose that's what made you so useful on Tython and Korriban. Thanks for giving us everything we need. Now we can get started in earnest. Not everything. Garima's dead. Oh, we don't need Garima himself, not anymore. We only ever needed the results of his research.
Moving on. Emergency pod's almost secure, but not quite. You with the Republic, aren't you? That's right. I'm also saving your lives. You got a problem with that? As a matter of fact, I do. Figured. Guess we'll have a chat about that when you get to the surface. Hurry! I wasn't built to survive the crushing depths! <laughs> okay, all set. Climb in and enjoy the ride. Welcome back. Once again, you've displayed a skill and determination that few possess. I've seen worse. Perhaps I should make proper introductions. No need to tell me who I'm addressing. I'm Theron Shan, Republic SAS, and your new ally. Do not presume to choose who I align myself with, nor allow them to address me as their equal. I fully understand your reluctance, but please, allow us to explain. The way we were fooled by Darth Arcus, the same happened to Theron, except with the Colonel. And between what you found down in that lab and what Lana and I pieced together, I can tell you they're both traitors. Arcus and Darak are in league with a dangerous movement, a shadowy cult known as the Order of Revan. The Order of Revan's no secret to me. I had run in with them on Drom and Kars. In an earlier incarnation, perhaps. They seem to have grown strong and bold. Very bold. The Order of Revan used to operate in the shadows of Imperial space, but now their ranks include at least one major Republic figure. That means I can't trust my people and Lana can't trust hers. Present company excluded. And if the Revanites are building an army of cyborgs... This is Chikara. And I am C2D4. Former translator to Her Eminence, Queen Lena of Onderon. Hey, Jakaro, how would you feel about helping me track those two down? <laughs> uh, we'll talk about it. Lana, will you be joining us? We don't yet know how deep the Revanite's influence runs. I must learn what I can from within the Empire. You've done well here, as expected. We'll speak again soon. Our work here is done. I was about to send out a search party. Sorry, I had to confirm some things before coming to see you. As I suspected, the Order of Revan as it once existed is no more. A bit of a shame, really. The Revanite's pragmatism may have been anathema to the Sith, but there was something appealing about it. You should know that I was made a Revanite. After crossing Darth Arcus, I doubt your membership stands. Not that the Revanites of now resemble the group as you understood it. The Order of Revan, as it stands now, doesn't wish to change the Empire from within. It aims to destroy us completely, and the Republic along with us. I've not yet learned why or how, but Theron Shan might. He appears to be rather good at his job. I hope you know what you're doing, working with the enemy like this. An SIS operative, no less. After what Arcus has done, after betraying me, the Empire, I'm not eager to trust anyone. I still believe Theron Shan will make a fine ally. Was there anything else you wanted to discuss? What do we know about Colonel Darok? Like Arcus. Darak held a great deal of sway. With the two of them combined, there's no telling how many are secretly working for them. I should get to my investigation. Whatever Arcus's Revanites and their infinite army has in store for the galaxy, it can't be good. May the Force ever serve you. Was there anything else you wanted to discuss? I think I'm starting to warm up to you, Lana. Is that right? You should know that the feeling's mutual. 
I have to go now. There's much yet to uncover about the Revenite's plans and the formation of this infinite army of theirs. I'll be thinking of you. <laughs>